super cool. Super cool! Goodbye! <sighs> Karen, that's one more for you to edit out. Uh, uh, edit all this out, Karen. I have a live Skype call going on right now with Karen. She watches pretty much everything that I do, and then she edits, and, and sometimes she'll she'll flash the screen and be like, hey, 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 do this. And I always put her on mute, because I don't want to hear her talk. <laughs> she flipped me the bird. <laughs> she's making lewd gestures all around. She's she's well-versed in uh, uh, sign language. But, uh, <laughs> stop. Gorgeous, I'm gorgeous, I'm gorgeous, I'm sexy. <laughs> Alright, I'm back. Got some juice going to the camera now. Still burping. No, we are getting ready for the big shoot coming up, and it's just taking a while. Which, again, there's nothing wrong with that. It's just, I don't know, it's a process. You, you get used to it around here. Having to make sure I'm doing everything legally, for one, because that, that seems to be a big point of contention. I'm going to go ahead and lower the camera down a bit. That seems to be a big point of contention, is uh, whether I'm doing everything legally, and the answer is yes, I am doing everything legally. Or, as legally as I can. I mean, I'm, I'm following every state law, and yet... There, there seems to be people constantly trying to block me. Well, what land are you doing this on? Well, is it going to be private land or public land? Is it going to be CRP? Is it going to be land where you're going to damage? Like, I, I, I'm, I'm in a battle right now with the DOW, the Division of Wildlife here, over whether there's prairie chickens out there, over whether they've uh, released black-footed ferrets. It's, you know, it's just stupid stuff. It's like it's it's not a big deal. Of course, I want to keep critters safe. I don't I don't want to blow up anything except for prairie dogs. And I don't know. It's just it's all the laws and hoops and jumps that you have to go through because I want this to be very safe for everyone involved. Uh, I've got a I've got a crew coming in that is going to make this happen. Whew. And it's just going to be a process. Uh, I would actually I would like to thank. Mike, by the way, uh, who owns the Holiday Motel and who comes shooting with me from time to time. He, uh, he gave me a chair, an office chair, and it is super duper comfortable, and it's super duper sexy, and I absolutely love it because I spend a lot of time editing these days, it seems like, and it is so... let's not knock stuff over here. I'm going to be lazy and put my feet up. It is super nice to have a chair that is mesh in the back. That way I don't get all nasty and sweaty in this thing. And 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 for him to uh, to think of that and, and to help out with the Barn Owl Project is just huge to me. Uh, he, he's just been a great friend throughout the years and, and I'm super excited to have known him. And so I think, Mike, that officially makes you a sponsor of the Barn Owl Project. So, so thank you for, for helping us here and helping uh, with what we do. Uh, I'm so grateful. I, I absolutely love this office chair. I think it's dupe. Anyway, uh, so we, we're, we're just trying to get so much done for that stupid shoot, man. And it sucks. Because it just seems like everyone wants to fight us, fight us on what we're doing. And we're trying to go about this legally and everything, so it shouldn't be a big deal. They're just making it out to be a big deal. Uh, we, we've enlisted the help of, of Netherton Customs. He's going to get the, uh, the the car derby ready for, for whenever we uh, trash it. Uh, uh, JJ, a good friend of mine, uh, owner-operator of Netherton Customs, he, he is also currently the reigning champion of the... Uh, 
the the derby at the the Pueblo State Fair. He he actually took the truck class last year, and so I mean the guy the guy builds great derby trucks. Period. Uh, great derby cars, and and hoping to see you again in the in the winter circle there, JJ. He's going to be coming in. He's going to help us get the car ready, and it's just a big conglomerate. Um, Koala Photography is going to be doing a lot of the filming for us. I'll put uh, links in the description of what I think of today down there. I, I will I will get all of that down in the description below. So that way you can go check them out if you'd like. I'll put the, the Holiday Motel. Highly encourage you to stop in there if you're ever coming through. And, and I'll, I'll reiterate all this again whenever we get ready for the big filming. Uh, the, the big shoot. Nine fifteen, and I'm already just exhausted, and you guys can't see it, but I've got just this entire desk covered with crap of, of editing and everything else that I need to do, and I'm just not getting it done. I'm not staying on top of things. There, were, there was something else I was going to talk about today. I started out talking about the ARs. We, we did go out and shoot. Ugh. Blackout is running great. Standard 223 uppers running great. Haven't had a malfunction yet. Uh, miserable today is part of why I didn't film. Uh, we had 50 mile an hour winds out at my hill. <laughs> I think anyone who's, who's watched this channel at all knows it's always blown out at the hill. Is what it is again. But no, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get some editing done for you guys tonight. So maybe I can actually put up a video tomorrow. Uh, besides another stupid vlog. Because I know how much you guys love those. And and we'll see where we go from there. <laughs> God, my hair is a disaster. I'm getting a haircut tomorrow too. So, so stop looking at my hair. I'm sexy. I know it. But that I can hear this camera blinking and dinking again. It's driving me insane. We will get out there. And we are going to get back to stuff. Just a process. Uh, money's rolling back in. I'm going to have a little extra funds. That's what I was going to say. Please, if you think of a gun that you guys want me to review right now or you want me to shoot or you've you've looked at that you'd like me to shoot, uh, let me know. I'd be happy to go out and buy a gun. I just I haven't been buying guns lately. In fact, I've been selling a lot of guns lately, and that's not something I like to do. We're going to get back to it, guys. I hope you guys stick around. I know I haven't got a shooting video up. I'll throw up some quick video of what I did get of the ARs. It's not going to be much. Uh, just just kind of dicking around. And no video today. <sighs> this is normally the day I do all my stuff on. Wednesdays, Thursdays are normally the days that I get all my filming done. Just having... I've been out there, been shooting, getting everything ready for the big one. And so that's what we're doing. I, I don't know if I'm going to start doing daily vlogs. I really hope not because I think they're boring as piss. I hate standing in front of the camera here and talking to you freaks. Sitting in front of the camera and talking to you guys. It's just, it's not something I really enjoy. I don't, I don't want to sit here in front of cameras all day. I get enough of that throughout my life. Uh, you know, it is what it is. So again, big thanks to Netherton Customs. I really appreciate it, man. Thank you so much for your help and support with this. Big thanks to Koala Photography, who is going to be doing all the videoing, all the filming for us. Uh, she's going to be taking all the pictures. Uh, big thanks to the Holiday Motel and Mike. Uh, you've been such a blessing as a friend. Thank you so much for being here, and thank you to you guys who are watching this video. Because, uh, I don't know. I won't get all sappy and emotional, but you guys are special. I really do enjoy having you here with me. It's just fun. Uh, God, my motion tracking on the camera is going insane. I just got this little square bouncing across the screen for... Every time that I do spastic movements with my face. But no, uh, thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you so much for coming along. 
we are going to get back to it. I promise I'm not putting you guys off. I'm not just jerking you guys along. We are going to get back to shooting. As soon as I stop yawning. Uh, but hopefully you guys come along for the party. We've got a lot to do. Uh, probably going to be getting a new motorcycle again. So look for a new bike this year. Probably not the old Honda all that much. I love riding it. It's a cool bike. I like working on it. But I've got, you know, a couple Yamahas sitting in the garage that I need to get fixed up. And I'd like a new bike again. So keep an eye out for that, guys. In the meantime, thank you so much for coming along. This is the Barn Owl Project. We are still just getting warmed up. Root beer and cheese puffs are still on me. I am going to kick back like this for a bit longer and then I'm going to get to edit in for you guys. I'm going to slam the laptop down on Karen so she quits giving me dirty looks. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Good luck, God bless, and I love you guys. <laughs> I, I'll, you don't think I'll freaking slam it down on you? I don't know if I just broke that. Uh-oh. I think I just broke the docking station. Nope, there it goes. Okay. See you, Karen. <laughs> Bye, dudes.